guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Yana Michelle, and in today's video, I'm going to be working with Hurella Hair on their new V part wig. This is a kinky curly V part, it is in 20 inches. So, if you're not already subscribed to my channel, go ahead, hit the subscribe button, turn on my post notifications so you are aware of when I post. And let's get straight into this video. So, as y'all can see, I had already opened it, <laughs> but Hurella Hair, and I have worked with them before. Good quality hair, so comes with a wig cap, comes with a satin bag to store your hair in, and then it does come with a headband and then the actual kinky curly unit. So let's get into this. Currently my hair is straight, so I'm just going to be doing the B part wig look with no leave out. Um, B part wigs you can do a leave out and you can do very very minimal leave out so that you're not going to experience damage The good thing about this kinky curly unit is that Since it is curly You can style it in so many different ways so you can rock it curly if you want to or you can blow dry it out Do a blow dried look or you can even um, straighten it and do a straight hair look. So this is the hair Straight off the package. It is really gorgeous like it looks very, very similar to my curl type. So this is really, really pretty hair. And of course, it looks like shrunken, but stretched out is 20 inches. So keep that in mind when you're ordering curly hair, is that even if it's 20 inches, it's going to look shorter than 20 inches because it's in its curly state. Okay. And then also, here is the V shape of the wig. And then it does have the clip comb attachments so that it's nice and secure. So yeah guys, this wig is so beautiful. I really love this texture. Like it really mimics mine really good. And it's nice and defined. So for my hair right now, I kind of did like some ghetto anchor braids. So there's one right here, one right there. And my hair is parted down the middle. That's usually how you wear a V-part wig. And then um, my hair is just pulled back. And so I had to do it like that because my hair is straight, but your natural hair underneath you could just do two anchor braids make them better than mine i suck at french braiding but make two little anchor braids and then the these um clips right here will clip onto it better so i'm gonna just go ahead and undo those clips and it does have the adjustable strap in the back if you need and yeah v part wigs are so simple i've been rocking them lately um and if you did do a leave out you would just where I have the anchor braids, you would just straighten that hair. Well, not straighten them because this is a curly wig. You would just leave it out curly and then define it and blend it in with this wig. But when you're doing no leave out, that's when you get the full blown protective style anyway. So what I'm doing is I'm clipping that onto the part that I did. But yeah, with no leave out, you are getting more of a protective style because now all of your hair is put away. And I always recommend before putting wigs on, you do want to like treat your scalp and your hair and make sure it's nice and moisturized because you don't want dry hair underneath your wigs. So I always recommend to people my um, hair products from Lavish Curls Beauty. It's always linked in the bio. It's my hair care brand and it's perfect for your own natural hair but it's also perfect for wig care and just um, taking care of your hair underneath so it can continue to grow and flourish even when you have a wig on and then also I do have new styling products which would be perfect for curly hair units so there's a curl defining cream a styling custard and a curling custard so this is what the hair is looking like so far I actually want to pull this just a bit closer and if you know how to French braid better than I do, um, it would click onto those braids better. But for the most part, that's pretty much good. So this is what it looks like. Fresh little look, as y'all can see. hair is super super nice so close up if you want to you can kind of run your v 
fingers through it to make it a little bit more realistic looking if you're one of those people that like a little frizz also if you want like a layered effect it kind of already looks layered but you could always cut the very front to give it a shorter appearance so that it could look a little bit more voluminous but other than that guys it's such a quick easy install perfect for the summer slash spring season coming up it's also perfect if you don't fully feel like doing your hair but you want that curly wash and go look because all you have to do is leave out a little bit of your real hair at the top and then rock this wig or you can do no hair left out at all like I'm doing and you're good to go so I like it fluffed out better I feel like that made it look really good so yeah guys this is the hair feels good no shedding nice and soft good quality hair so if you haven't already checked out Corella hair I will have them linked in the description box below make sure you check them out shop their website they have different variety of wigs so you're sure to find something that you like over there do not forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys hello stranger it's been a minute